Hey guys, it has literally been so long since I've talked to a camera. I'm just gonna give you a live update and just talk about what I've been up to. So I got two things during my IKEA trip a couple weeks back. The first one that I got is just this monitor stand. This isn't going to be for my monitors. It's mostly just gonna add more space for my stationary stuff. So I aim to put this over there. We will just see how it goes. I just want to change it up a little because I feel like I've grown tired of that setup. It comes like this already. It comes with the insert. Yeah, okay, let's just put this on top. Mind you, I do not have a plan. I'm just figuring it out as we go. So I'll just give a little update. So if you've been wondering where I've been lately, I have a job just so I can earn some money on this side while I'm going through my last unit of university. I have one more unit slash subject and that is an internship. It has been a crazy experience. I would have liked to record my progress and like from start to finish what my experience was like from the beginning but I will be honest right now it is not amazing. It's not great. I didn't expect it to be this way. I'm not feeling that great about the internship. It's probably just the place I'm doing it at. I just feel like I'm not really being supported that well and it's very discouraging given that it's kind of like my first experience in the field doing graphic design and so this is my first time kind of working in the real world and knowing what it's like being in an office and being around people in the same kind of field it's just discouraging i don't feel like i'm learning a lot i my confidence has definitely depleted because of this experience unfortunately kind of just have to do it because it's a part of my course and if i don't i can't graduate you know so i've just been trying to balance my internship with life as well as work and just other hobbies and socializing and health and all of that and it's been pretty overwhelming i must say i'm constantly tired and how i've been relaxing is i've been playing a lot of overwatch which is crazy because I used to distance myself from games like Overwatch because it looks so fast paced and I get motion sickness a lot but I tried it out and I'm obsessed with Overwatch it's so fun I kind of just use that game to wind down a lot of the times okay I have decided that this is the best setup that I can come up with right now but I think I'm gonna change this section and put the mild liners back where I got them originally just because like all of my markers and stuff are already in like a convenient spot that I might as well just leave it as it is because it was working originally I was just thinking about what I could talk about and I realized there is something that I haven't really addressed in the video and it's the fact that I got hacked so I got hacked in like around March I will be honest that really took a toll on me and my ability to create videos some context i got hacked and i almost lost my youtube channel but i was able to get in contact with youtube themselves and they were able to help me get it back i would say that i'm a little bit traumatized i don't know if this is the right word because obviously there's worse things that could happen right i don't know i just I'm terrified that I'm just gonna lose everything and this situation has caused me to really cherish my channel but it's ironic because right after I got hacked all my motivation to create videos just went out the window because it kind of made me feel like oh all my hard work could easily just disappear or just like it might not be worth it because it's just gonna go away eventually and it's it's dumb saying that out loud and just dumb thinking about it but that's just how I felt. I've been scared. I haven't been that active on social media. I feel like my confidence, again, has just depleted severely. And because I'm also becoming more and more inactive, that's just making it worse. I just feel like there's not really a lot of worth in the stuff that I create. Which is, again, dumb to say. I shouldn't think that way, but I can't help it. But yeah, that is another reason as to why i haven't been so active i'm slowly getting better my mind's just all over the place to be honest on the bright side look at what my friend got me isn't this so cute she went to korea recently and she got me this little cute my melody photo album 
I might print out some little photos and just put it inside here. Speaking of traveling, since my friend traveled to Korea, I'll just bring it up here. But on the brighter side of things, I am actually planning to travel this year and I'm going to be going to Japan, which is very fun. If you've been here for a while, you know that I went in 2019 and I had so much fun. Like every year, basically, I think about going back to Japan and I'm finally going to be able to go. The tickets have been purchased, accommodation is being booked, and everything is being planned. Traveling for the first time with my partner. And since like we're both into Japanese culture, Japanese food, anime, music, all of that, I think it's going to be really fun. Since the last time I went to Japan, I wasn't really into anime. I didn't watch anime or really consume that much Japanese culture other than the food. It's definitely gonna be a whole new experience going and I just know my wallet is gonna be suffering but it's worth it. And I'm definitely gonna vlog it because you know, how often do you really go to Japan, you know? My camera died so I'm just gonna wait for it to charge so i'm on my other camera but this is what the setup is looking like i think it's good enough for me the next item i got from ikea is the famous trolley that you know everyone has i already own a white trolley and i have all of my stationery on that i decided to get another one as of the past year i've been into reading i've been buying a lot of books and as you can see from my bookshelf over here, I have a lot of books or a decent amount of books. It's not the biggest collection, but there are books here that are just sitting on the side and they can't fit in the bookshelf. So I thought, let me get a trolley to put my books on it or books that are waiting to be read. Because I've been seeing a lot of people have like their own TBR trolley and it looks so cute and I want more color in my room and I want more warmth. I got myself a yellow trolley. I just feel like it's gonna be a fun color and it's gonna look interesting in my room but the funny thing is i bought this so that you know once i get more books i can just put it all in this trolley but because i've been into reading i've also fallen down the rabbit hole of kindles and here's what's funny i've been getting so many tiktoks about kindles that i've been convinced that i need a kindle and since my friend and my cousin they have kindles and they talk about how like convenient it is and how fun it is to have i've just been like thinking about it for a while like maybe i should get a kindle because i have been getting into a reading slump lately as well i just feel like a kindle would kind of help me because it's easier to read on a kindle so literally the other day i spontaneously got a kindle and mind you i am so in love with this it is so cute and small and convenient i carried this to my internship yesterday i read on the train i read a lot on the train the battery life is great it's just convenient and so cute i'm actually gonna decorate this maybe in this video i'll decorate this it's ironic that i got a kindle because i got a trolley for physical books so since i have a kindle i'm not gonna be buying as much physical books so what am i gonna do with this trolley this is what happens when you get money and you're an adult but yeah this is the color isn't this so cute i think it's gonna add a bit more color to my room surely this isn't gonna be too hard right Thank you. 
are right now No longer 17 oh. Have we been around? Got some years on us And a new bell as a sea So we're here, but it's still Up here inside your dream land Wind, but it's still Up here inside your sleep and Does he know about our time Inside your M cycle And that I'm on the way Where the night goes Brown eyes from the waist down. I know what you like. Could we cram it sometimes. Once before the big sun arises. Oh, though this may not be real, it's the closest thing. Yeah. I, I, though you face the gray, I could touch it. Yeah. One time to pick you. Say hello. Hello, it is a new day. Today, I'm gonna be going to the shops. This Saturday, my godson is celebrating his first birthday and it is a costume party. And the theme is to dress up as your favorite anime character or cartoon character. And since I didn't have much time to really pick out a very sophisticated outfit, I decided to choose May from Turning Red. I already bought a red sweater. It's not gonna be 100% accurate, but I'm gonna try and get as many similar things as I can today. So my plan is to get some burgundy tights or leggings because she kind of wears something like that under her denim skirt. And I also want to get some green hair clips. On top of that, I also need to buy a gift for the birthday boy and I guess if I end up buying anything else. But that is the plan for today. I don't know if I'm gonna talk while I'm out because I'm shy, but I'll try to film as much as I can. everything that I got today oh my gosh so the main things that I wanted to get today was 
things for the party so since i'm gonna dress up as may from turning red i wanted to get maroon or burgundy colored tights because she wears those under her denim skirt and i didn't expect to struggle so much trying to find tights in that color the only tights i could find were all like black and dark blue but thankfully i managed to find some at alley they are like this ribbed material but this is close enough yeah i tried it on it is a little bit long that's just the struggle of being like five one i also needed to get hair clips she wears like this bright green hair clip as well as some bobby pins and the bobby pins that she uses or wears they're like pink but i couldn't find colored bobby pins i just bought bobby pins these are like gold and i went to best and less i knew that they would have hair accessories specifically ones that are good for school i ended up buying some but these like i think this is a little too dark for what i was going for but i ended up buying it anyway but then after buying this i went to another store and then i found these it's just like colored ones and there's like this green one here that i think would match better because it's like this bright green i don't know what i'm gonna do with the rest of these but yeah i don't know if i will be using these or these i also went to daiso today i knew that i was gonna walk out with some of these razors these are so useful when shaping eyebrows and when i was paying for these the girl at the counter when she was serving me she randomly just asks if i'm on instagram and then she just reveals that she knows who i am and that she's been following me since i've been doing journaling and i was so like awkward and shy um but yeah that was such a crazy experience because i've never been recognized in public i was just thinking about that interaction the whole time i was like walking around because i was just overthinking like oh was i too awkward i feel so bad but yeah that was so sweet i feel so honored i don't know i'm like an average person so it was just like out of the blue right but yeah i got these from daiso and i met a new lovely friend there my camera's gonna die but i also got something from jd since the costume party is a birthday celebration for my godson i got him a little set isn't that so cute i hope he likes it or i hope his parents like it so cute that was my day i am just going to rest up a little bit i hope you enjoyed that little haul So it's been a few hours since I got home from the party. Just gonna chill for the rest of the night. I do want to see if I could like open this up and see how it works. I'm just gonna do that before we end this video. I can't believe I trekked two hours just so I could buy a light stick. But at least I'm going to 
go crazy at the concert. They even gave me a free photo card thing of Blackpink. This is so weird, but when I first like opened it and like looked at it like this, it looks like a uterus. Is that weird to say? Oh my god. This is so much fun. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna go and show my siblings, but I'm gonna end this video here. I hope you enjoyed seeing what I've been up to lately. Life has been crazy. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a good day. Please take care of yourselves and I will just see you in my next one. Bye-bye. I ever wanna be So let me be